I guess <laughs> motocross for me, like I came into riding dirt bikes. It, it just all kind of, I don't know. I was all, I wasn't like a normal kid that like really likes what is it, stick and ball sports or you know running or this and that. Like I was always kind of an independent like kid, and, like surfing and this and that. You know, like independent things and mostly like action sports is really what I was drawn to, like skateboarding and. BMX, you know, like just things where you you weren't being told what you had to do like by a coach and you know they weren't really team sports. So like as a little kid I really grew up with with that of you know having independence. My first taste of riding um anything like uh my my parents they used to send me back uh to Oregon to live with my cousins. I used to go back there and my cousins, like they're gnarly, like beard mountain men, like way more not like so gnarly, like just, ah, oh, mm, really don't give a uh about nothing. They're like all into like four wheel drive, big trucks and swamp bogging and motorcycles. Like that was it. So basically when I was living with them, like we lived in a little single wide, it was like so crip. They go riding out there in Oregon and like I was just a little weasel so they put me on the gas tank, you know, and I, I'd hold on to the, the crossbar pad, like the handlebars and um, they put like a little helmet on me and we'd just go rip, man, like, you know, and I remember like when I was just, just a little grom, like they had a big, like this big hill with a lip on it and they used to jump it and um, they used to put me on the front and like make me like, okay, Larry, you know, grip onto the gas tank and hold onto the handlebars. And, and uh, we'd ride and I, we we you know, catch air. And I remember like that feeling of just like, just, you know, the freedom and just, you know, the adrenaline of, you know, just being like in the air and just jumping and riding the dirt bike was just so, like for me, it's like unexplainable. It's like that passion of something, you know? And like, for me, it like, gave me that passion. And it wasn't until I was older that I was like reintroduced to motorcycles and you know got into it and you know re, re felt that feeling of passion and, and you know freedom. You know, first and foremost, the, the most important thing for me is you know <clears throat> really educating youth, you know, and you know older people as well. I just want to really move people in a positive direction, but you know, still, still show like, hey, you don't have to be that clean, laced, you know, like fake smile, trident, whatever, you know, guy. Like, you know, you could, you could just be a public animal, and you know, still, you know, have morals and respect, and you know, be gnarly. You know, the, the message behind Metal Musher, the reason that that started, you know, was basically to help out, you know, the underdog, to, to be there for, you know, the, the the less fortunate person, you know, and that's 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 what the roots of it are, and like, that's what it is still today, and that's like, really what, what I, I try to be the glue of, for the brand of Metal Militia, is to, you know, really give back, you know, not take, you know, not take, keep take, 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 taking, but you know, it's a brotherhood of family, of, of all of us guys, and, give back help one another another out you know and that's that's basically that's that, that that's always been the intention of it has been you know where you know strength in numbers oh man i want lincoln to remember about his dad that his dad always makes black bean and cheese burritos for dinner every night. <laughs> Do you really? <laughs> he does. <laughs> he does. It's so funny. Every night pretty much, besides when we uh besides when we go out, it's always black bean burritos. <laughs> and then when grandma comes over she like makes me something sweet, but when you're when you're on the part it's always black bean burritos. <laughs> <laughs> the black bean burritos. Dude, black bean burritos.